Hey there. I'm Alex from Pure Nutrition, and I'm super excited to guide you through a simple, natural journey to support your kidney health. Just like how we keep our skin fresh and clean, taking care of our kidneys can be straightforward and gentle too. In this video, I'll share with you four easy steps to help detox your kidneys using just herbs and natural remedies you can find at home. No fancy ingredients or tools needed, just simple, effective ways to give your kidneys the love and care they deserve. So, why focus on kidney health? Well, I'll dive into that and more, showing you how you can nurture your kidneys and feel great doing it. When was the last time you gave your kidneys a little extra love with a detox? But before we dive into this amazing kidney detox recipe, let's chat about how to make the most of it. If you're truly committed to rejuvenating your kidneys, think of this detox as part of a holistic approach to your health. Start by preparing your body at least a week in advance. How? Simply by cutting out all those things that don't serve your well-being, like chemicals, toxins, added sugars, GMOs, fried and processed foods. And yes, it's a great idea to put a pause on smoking and drinking too. Remember, what's good for your overall health is fantastic for your kidneys as well. That's why I'm a big advocate for a healthy lifestyle, drinking plenty of water, getting enough sleep, maintaining a healthy weight, and staying active. All these steps create the perfect environment for your kidneys to thrive and recover fully during the detox. So, let's get started and give your kidneys the best chance for a happy, healthy reset. Alright, let's dive into this wonderful recipe, and we'll start with a key ingredient, dandelion. Grab your notepad, and let's list it, dandelion, including its leaves and roots. These aren't just ordinary garden weeds, they've been a natural remedy for kidney, liver, gallbladder, and joint issues for centuries. Here's an interesting tidbit. A study published in the Journal of Ethnopharmacology in 2011 praised dandelion for its effectiveness in treating urinary tract infections. It's also seen as a gentler, more natural alternative to antibiotics for UTIs. But that's just the start. Dandelions are nutrient powerhouses, rich in vitamins C and A, and iron. They're known for easing inflammation and potentially helping to dissolve kidney stones. Plus, as natural detoxifiers, they're an excellent first choice for our kidney cleanse. Now, where to find them? Dandelions are readily available in many places. You can check your local health food stores, supermarkets, especially in the organic section, and even online. Speaking of online, popular platforms like Amazon and eBay are fantastic options. They often have a range of dandelion products, from fresh plants to supplements. Just a tip, opt for organic to ensure you're getting the best quality without any unwanted chemicals. Let's chat about another fantastic ingredient for your kidney health, stinging nettle. You might have heard about it as it's a popular herbal remedy for various kidney-related issues. Stinging nettle is a fantastic herb, well known for its medicinal properties, especially when it comes to supporting kidney health. This herbal remedy, recognized as a medicinal herb in many European countries, is a little powerhouse. The magic of stinging nettle lies in its active components, such as lectins and polysaccharides. These natural compounds have anti-inflammatory properties because they help reduce the production of prostaglandins, substances known to cause inflammation. What's really great about stinging nettle is how it works when you increase your water intake. This combination promotes more fluid movement through your kidneys and urinary tract, effectively acting as a natural form of irrigation therapy. Now, if you're thinking, where can I find stinging nettle? It's actually quite easy. While you might not have it growing in your backyard, you can easily find it in the form of sifted leaves. 
and for convenient shopping, check out online platforms like Amazon and eBay. They offer a variety of options, including certified organic stinging nettle sifted leaves. So, let's get ready to give your kidneys the gentle, natural support they deserve with some high-quality stinging nettle. Let's talk about something delicious and kidney-friendly, cranberry juice. Cranberries, and their juice, are fantastic for naturally preventing urinary tract infections, UTIs. There's been quite a bit of research on this, and the findings are clear. The active compound in cranberries, called tannin, is a natural UTI fighter. It works by stopping bacteria from sticking to the walls of the bladder and urethra, which is pretty impressive. But here's a key point. The effectiveness of cranberry juice largely depends on the dosage. For maintaining urinary tract health, typically, drinking about 8 to 10 ounces, 240 to 300 milliliters, of 100% cranberry juice daily is recommended. This amount is thought to be effective in preventing UTIs and supporting kidney health. Just a reminder, when shopping for cranberry juice, aim for the 100% organic kind to avoid added sugars and preservatives. Alternatively, cranberry supplements can be a convenient and effective choice. Either way, incorporating cranberries into your routine is a delicious way to care for your kidneys. Let's explore a natural gem for your health, apple cider vinegar. This isn't just your regular kitchen ingredient, it's a total body detoxifier, an immune booster, and a key player in our kidney detox plan. Apple cider vinegar has been a trusted remedy for countless health issues over the centuries, and modern science backs many of these benefits. It's known to aid in managing diabetes, certain types of cancer, high cholesterol, weight loss, and urinary tract problems. No wonder it's a big hit in the natural health community. Now, you might be wondering, what's in it for my kidneys? Apple cider vinegar contains acetic, phosphorus, and citric acids, which are really good at breaking down kidney stones. Plus, these components help prevent bacteria from sticking to the bladder walls, creating a hostile environment for UTIs. Now, Here's a simple way to use apple cider vinegar for kidney health. Mix 1 to 2 tablespoons of raw, unfiltered apple cider vinegar with a large glass of water, about 12 to 16 ounces. Drink this mixture once or twice daily. Drinking it before meals is often recommended for the best absorption and effectiveness. As for the best time of day, Drinking it in the morning can kickstart your metabolism and digestive system, providing a gentle detox effect throughout the day. However, some people prefer drinking it in the evening as it can have a soothing effect and help with digestion. Remember, it's important to listen to your body and adjust as needed. If you have pre-existing health conditions, especially related to the kidneys, it's always wise to consult with a healthcare professional before adding apple cider vinegar or any new remedy to your routine. Now, let's chat about how to weave these amazing herbs and home remedies into your daily life. Before diving into the kidney cleanse, which should last at least three days, start prepping a week in advance. How? By cutting out all the nasties from your diet. This means saying goodbye to chemicals, sugars, GMOs, fried and processed foods. And, to really max out the benefits of this cleanse, it's a good idea to pause your alcohol and smoking habits too. During your three-day cleanse, kick off each morning with a nourishing tea made from dandelion and stinging nettle. Here's a simple recipe. Pour 9 ounces of boiling water over 1 and a half teaspoons each of dandelion leaf flakes and stinging nettle leaf. Remember to use purified water, not demineralized, for the best quality. Let it infuse for about 10 minutes, then it's ready to enjoy. Feel free to add a touch of honey for sweetness. Sip on 1 cup of this tea twice a day. 
In addition, twice a day, mix two tablespoons of apple cider vinegar in a cup of water. A little honey can help make the taste more pleasant. Don't forget your cranberry juice, aim for at least 8 ounces a day. And, water is key. In total, try to drink about 3.7 liters or 125 ounces of fluids daily, including your teas and juices. The trick is to spread it out, drinking in small amounts throughout the day. Are you thinking about giving your kidneys a gentle, natural cleanse? That's fantastic! Just remember, while staying hydrated is key, drinking large amounts of water all at once isn't the best approach. It's all about balance. Now, for an extra boost to your kidney cleanse, let's talk about the special kidney detox tea. This powerful recipe is perfect if you're considering extending your cleanse to a full week after the initial three days. It's proven to be effective and can really enhance the results of a standard kidney cleanse. Here's how to whip up this amazing kidney detox tea. First, gather these ingredients from a trusted brand. 1. Horsetail, known for its diuretic, antioxidant, and anti-inflammatory properties. 2. Marshmallow root, a potent antioxidant, excellent for urinary tract health. 3. Uversi, great for neutralizing unwanted organisms in the urinary tract. 4. Goldenrod, an aquaretic agent, helpful in treating kidney stones. Now, let's make the tea. In a heat-resistant glass pot, add 2 cups of purified water. Mix in 1 tablespoon of horsetail, half a tablespoon of marshmallow root, half a tablespoon of uversi and one tablespoon of goldenrod. Let the mixture soak overnight. In the morning, gently simmer the pot for about six minutes. Enjoy the tea warm or let it cool and sip the two cups throughout the day. Avoid artificial sweeteners. A bit of brown sugar or honey is perfect for adding a touch of sweetness. For more in-depth information about this kidney detox tea, feel free to check out the videos in our description. Now, you might be wondering, how often should I do a kidney detox? Well, Michael Wright, a fellow kidney health enthusiast, detoxes every three months, at the start of each season. If that sounds a bit much, you could start with twice a year. That's it for today. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe and don't hesitate to drop any questions in the comments. Thanks for watching, and here's to your kidney health.